Ray. Hello. Ray. I'm Listen. reading every comment on Reddit. <laughs> Ray, don't. I'm not kidding you. You're going to go down a terrible rabbit hole with this, and you can't beat the internet. I like seriously. I think your best thing to do is to just not respond to any of that. It's just not. It's literally I feel just like not I. Ha I literally. You don't, you don't. I. You don't have to. I feel like I have to. No, Ray. There's there's no point because you can't beat them. They're just gonna keep shitting on you. You. I would. If I were you, I would just walk away. Like, do not respond to this at all. It's not worth it. Anything you say is going to be clipped and you're going to get shit on. I would just thing, walk away. Okay. The reason why I do feel it's important to talk about the friend part at least is because like I have had a friend reach out and was so torn why I didn't mention them when I mentioned like half the people that did reach out. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it actually, what I did is actually hurting them. And yeah. It, and I and now I didn't realize name dropping was I didn't I didn't think about the way that it's being perceived. Right. Which right. feels like I it's understand. a lot of Listen, I've been in your situation where I've gotten Oh really? Two, three years ago. Oh yeah. <laughs> You've been in this I, situation? Where I where I, uh okay, old Mizkiff got leaked by Destiny and Destiny's community went after me. I was in a similar situation. I, right, I was in a worse situation. I literally thought I was canceled. I thought my career was over. I'm like, that's it, I'm done. I had 3K viewers and I'm like, this is the end of my career. I was going live to pretty much say I'm sorry to never stream again. But when I could say, I know what mental state you're in. It's like, you're in shock. There's a lot of pain going through you. You're not even saying the right things that you wanna say because you're just so, like there's nerves and all these other things. So. If your friend, whoever got upset, should realize that it's you weren't really thinking and speaking from the heart. There was also a lot of nerves that went with it. Um, I just, like I know you, you know what I mean? I just feel like the way I said things, I understand how it's being misinterpreted and it's driving me crazy. Like, I feel like I'm actually like. I, I feel how do you not talk? About, like, how do I sleep at night knowing that? Like, I, I did this. You know what I mean? Ray, you want to know how you could sleep at night? Because you could say to yourself, and this is the reality of it, in two days, no one's going to care. I think it's going to be at least a, a week. <laughs> even if. Like, this is, this is a big deal. Even, even if it's a week, Ray, no one's going to care. And, and it's going to blow over. Hassan's going to say something stupid. They're going to be on his ass, and you're going to be free. Like, you got to realize that. The... The, least you, the less you talk about it, the more this will go away. Now, it, is there a lot of fucked up things with this? Yes. I mean, like- There's is there things so you much fucked up shit with this, Miz. Yeah. Like, this is so bad. I had to delete my other VOD because illegal. Like, I- Oh, shit. I might actually- I might have actually fucked up. Right. You just have to- <laughs> telling, Right. You just have to stop talking. I, I, I think I that's- I can't stop you talking. Ha, right. I know it sucks. It sucks. I know it feels like shit. But the less you talk about it, the more stuff's going to happen. Look at today. Like, it just blew up because you were talking. you you got to stop talking. You have to just – you ha you know what I mean? It, it sucks. I know it's painful. I know you just want to talk to people and, and, like, let out all your issues and problems. But that's what you should probably do. Like, you going through Reddit right now, Ray, it's going to do nothing. It's They're just going to clip more shit. They're just going to comment on it. They're going to clip your YouTube channel. They're going to make more stuff about it. It's not worth it. What do I you do know, then? I, I think your best bet is to just straight up go offline and just... I What I would do is this. This is my opinion. I think you should make... If you want to really address this, I think you should make a well-thought-out video. That's just me. Oh, because, God. Or, yeah, I know. Or a tweet or something that maybe you have peers read. I just feel like it's more... It just is... I feel like it's more genuine if I'm just live. And just, it is I, more genuine, I don't, right? Like, I'm not reading a script. Like, I'm not, I don't want to edit a video. Like, I don't want to, like, I don't want to have to tweet out where, like, a PR has to read it. Like, I just feel like this is the... There, there's, I, there's nothing, right. But the thing is, you're not clear-headed right now. So you're not speaking from the heart. You have a lot of emotions, bullshit, anxiety, stress, pressure, emotions. You know what I mean? You have a, when you're speaking, when you just spoke today, you're not just speaking straight from the heart. There's a lot of other stuff. You're also thinking about your legal team the entire time. You know, you weren't thinking necessarily in the moment. You weren't necessarily thinking like clear headed. So 
I personally do think it's better for you to either A, make a, a well thought out tweet or a well thought out video. So that way you can really make sure that everything you feel is perfectly addressed. Yeah, you're probably right. It you know? just, I the just worst feel you could so do is bad right for now. my friends. Like I did not mean for it to come off that way and it did. I, I look, I think if any of your friends understand what you're going through, they would understand that you're not speaking perfectly and rationally, right? Like you didn't mention my name for some crazy reason when I said that I reached out. And you, you said, did reach stuff. out. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I well, it's I like I, I didn't, I, I God, I just didn't think about how that could be taken. Like I, no. people are calling me a narcissist, which is like, well, you're a streamer. It comes with the bag. You know what I mean? Like, I'm a narcissist. And what's going on, chat? Like, they know. I don't want to be like but... you. Why does everyone what say the that? Heck? What? It's not that bad, Ray. Look, I, no one shits on me for anything. You know, I, I did something worse than you did. I made a merch called Yo, and I sold it as designer wear, and I didn't get canceled for it. Because people know I'm a horrible human being. Join the club. This is so different. <laughs> This situation is so different than that. I don't know. I mean, you, you put my yo merch through the wash and it becomes o merch. You know what I mean? Like, it, it literally just, it was garbage. Oh I, God, I, at so least your merch bad. was quality. Mine was shit. But I, you're going through a lot, Ray. I mean, I think you're going through a lot. But the last thing I think you should do is be going through Reddit. It really is. It's just not going to help you. Right? The damage is done. And I know you want to try to fix it and put a band-aid on it. And, I mean, not even a, not even a band I don't need a band-aid. I just want to just, some lotion. like. I, okay, too soon. Actually, too <laughs> soon. That's actually way too soon, first of all. <laughs> I just, oh, God. The last thing I want to do is involve my friends in this. And that was, like, what it happened. I, whatever. I, I, am I, I right when I say this? What? That you, you were speaking from nerves and anxiety, not necessarily from how you actually feel? I just think that you're entirely right on me not being clear-headed and I'm wording things horribly wrong. And I yes. think that a lot of people do know that I do have good intentions and I don't mean to, I'm not, I'm not trying to pass blame on anyone other than myself, but I'm wording things so bad. I'm, I'm not, I'm not saying things and that, right. That's why doing it live is so bad. Like, yeah, but I feel like Maya, it's the most authentic way. But then it's like you, everything gets taken out of. But it's this. not authentic. It's not how you really feel. Like me and Maya, when we broke up, we were going to go live and just talk about it. We were like, let's just go live right now. But like, would that really do anything? Because the reality is we're not clear headed. We're not in a good state of mind. We're upset. There's anxiety. There's stress. There's pressures. There's a lot of other stuff. Everyone's talking about us, us thinking about like how many viewers would be at, like while everyone's watching our every word that it's terrifying, right? It, you really don't get your point across when, you know, we just made a simple tweet. It was a one paragraph, but that, but that in itself says everything because what it says, is like, Hey, you know, we thought about this and, and it, it was, it was smooth. You know what I mean? You, you don't want to always be live. I know it feels authentic. And I know that makes sense, but you also have to be smart about it when feeling authentic. And I think right now you're just not in a good headspace. Yeah, I feel like I can't. I've mentally checked out a week ago. Yeah, yeah. But I feel, I, 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 I legit, I, people told me like I shouldn't stream today, but like I literally feel like I needed to say something today. Like I needed to. Yeah, see, you don't. You don't need to say shit. I, I mean, you should just think about it and, you know, talk about it before you say something, you know, I, I take your time, relax. Like, I, I know this. you're going through a lot of shit, right? But like I said, I think in a week, it will be nothing, you know? I mean, from the wise words of destiny, yeah, you scam some kids and something, but you know, train at Rex also gambles every day. So it, it, there's, it's not really a big deal and, and no one's going to really care. Like, I, I really think in a week, no one's going to give a shit. Honestly, Miz, you calling me really... Really helped. No, you're welcome. Did people really not reach out to you that much? No, people, people did. I'm just, it's, I was, the way I meant it was that I was differentiating between, like, there's a ton of creators, right? Literally all of my friends did reach out. And that's how I know that they were, like, my real friends because they actually cared about, like, my well-being, 
right? Mm. But like, there's also a lot of creators that like I'm mutual with that, you know, didn't give a shit to like reach out, which I like, I get it. But that's what I meant with my statement. I wasn't trying to shade my current friends. All of my friends reached out. But like the way yeah, it comes yeah. off is so bad. Like I worded it so bad. And, and the whole but... name dropping thing, like I, I forget that, you know, if I no, mentioned you, you someone, right people you... are going to like go after them or something as if they did something wrong. You did the right thing. You mentioned Hassan. That was important. No. Okay. Now that I hate Hassan. That was like, I didn't even know what he was. T I, okay. I, I don't even, I don't even, I don't even want to, I don't even want to talk about that. I already have talked Listen. about it. It just, I, I didn't mean it in like a bad way. <laughs> I just was confused that that was what he said. Oh God. And then he tweeted that he was like, oh God, I was off Reddit for one day. And then there I am. And that was my fault. Right. I, I, all I could say is this. I, I think your best bet is to just take a deep breath. Realize that in a week from now, you will have the same viewers. You will have the same community. And as time goes on, it will go away. Like, I'm not kidding. When, when Destiny's community canceled me, I, you have a platform, so you're good. You'll be fine, right? I, I literally thought it, was, I thought it was the end. Like, <sighs> I got like seven hate threads on live stream fails at once. Everyone was digging into me saying I'm a horrible human being. And I'm like, well, they figured me out. You know, it's over. I'm done. Um, do you think you know, that you're a bad person? Do I think I'm a bad person? Mm -hmm. Uh, God, I feel like now I'm talking to Dr. K. No, no I don't you think, need you need to say no. I don't. No, I don't think I'm a bad person. I don't think I'm a bad person. But you know, it just took like, uh, and I thought my career was over. I'm like, this is done. I went live at three in the morning to talk about what happened on live stream bills, doing what you j are doing right now. That's right? literally like, I'm right? Reading, it made it worse. I was reading it. No, I, I feel like. When I did it, it made it worse because everyone just started nitpicking what I'm saying and made it and then like commented on it. You know what I did? I just backed away for like three days. I walked away from Twitch. I'm like, I'm done. I'm not doing this. And then I came back. There was some hate in the beginning, right? But a, a couple of days later, it's like it never happened. And that's exactly what's going to happen with you. It's it's shit right now. It sucks. Uh, I understand. You understand why people are upset. It makes perfect sense. Yeah, I know but why, no, we, and it makes sense. Like I understand. Yeah, it will I be done. It. You know, it'll be it'll be good soon. You know, um, okay. it'll be good.